In this module, we will define various pressures in a well, as noted above. By the end of this module, you will know how to calculate each type of pressure and understand its significance in well control. The first pressure we will look at is the equivalent circulating density, or ECD. The ECD is the apparent mud weight acting on the bottom of the hole when the fluid is being circulated. Click the pump to circulate. Note that the bottom hole pressure, or BHP, increases with circulation. Now let's look at trapped pressure. In the well shown, the BOPs are shut in and the choke line valves open to the gauge. Bottom hole pressure equals formation pressure. Observe the gauges as the pump is inadvertently turned on and then turned off without opening any valves. Note that in this case, all the gauges increase by 200 PSI. Trapped pressure is like pumping up a car tire with air. The pressure increases everywhere in the system. Bottom hole pressure is now 200 PSI above reservoir pressure. Trapped pressure refers to the case where a well with a kick is shut in, is in a static condition. And by some means, closing the choke before the pump is shut down, for example, the pressure in the system has increased such that the BHP is greater than the formation pressure. 